units, level four mobilization. Location, Fisk Tower. Fisk? Fort Fisk Tower. All units stand by. Warrant is en route. Bring in the hammer. Building, we're gonna lose him. I'm gonna go, uh. Do your thing. Yes! He's the dick, Billy! Heads up! may be a dirty criminal, but he has remarkably clean air vents. It's clear! Move up! Hey guys, I guess bombs are part of Willie's getaway plan? Ah. Sounds like they're trapped. You go after them. We'll look for the bombs. Everyone clear out! Evacuate the building! Spider-Man! We can't move! When you're free, get out fast. If you can walk, help the injured. Got it? You guys all right? We were just about to call for backup. I think I'm it. Lead the way. We'll be right behind you. Heads up, boss.
Writing your memoirs? Don't forget the hyphen between spider and man. Get the chopper ready. I won't be long. I'm surprised you made it this far. But your foolishness ends now. Uh, you do know I can still see you, right? Oh, for me? You shouldn't have! Finally off to Rikers, huh? You know, I think you've got more enemies in there than I do. If you think this will be more than a minor inconvenience... Whoop! Well, gotta go. Hey, good luck, Willy. I have a feeling you're gonna need it. Idiot! I'm the one who kept order in this city! One month! In one month you wish you had me back! Martin, so sorry I'm late. You were right on time. Just keep her distracted while we get everything ready. You got it. Hey, there's my favorite aunt. Peter, what a nice surprise. Need some help? Uh, yeah, sure. Oh, there are some heavy no, boxes. No, no, no. I mean, I mean, I mean, not yet. I mean, I came to, uh, uh, uh I just, just wanted to talk. Um... Peter, are you in trouble? Do you need money? No, no I, mean, I mean, I'm a little behind on my rent, but... No, 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 I'm, I'm, I'm fine. Girl problems again, huh? What? No, that's crazy. I still wish you and MJ could work things out. She's a great girl. She is, but... The two of you would make some beautiful wow. baby. Uh... Peter. What is it? Come on, you can tell me. These past few years, you helping me through college and working here, and sacrificing so much and asking for nothing. I just wish there were more people like you in the world. He's right. Five years ago, you walked in here and told me you were inspired by my mission to help others. Now it's you who inspires me. Thank you, May, for everything. Here's for many more years of service. Thanks again for setting all this up. Oh, I just wish I could do more. Well, May's always told me if you help someone... You help everyone. <laughs> yeah, maybe we should send May to City Hall to have a word with the mayor. Oh, I gotta run. Um, thanks again for the party and everything. It, it, it really means a lot.
Now that you quit smoking, what do you tell people when you come up here? That I need a break from their crap. Fair enough. So, why'd you call? Need a date to the policeman's ball? You got a black and white suit? Uh... No ball this year anyway. We spent too much integrating Oscorp surveillance tech. Worth it though, right? It was. Till an hour ago. The well, system went down. How? We'll figure it out later. Right now we need to get the towers back online. Fast. And you called me? Aw, that's sweet. I called someone I could trust. Plus, the signals are scrambled and we have no idea how to fix it. Ooh. I love a challenge. You break it, you buy it. I thought you trusted me. Let's take a look at this tower. Flatbush Avenue exit. We just had a tower come back online. Was that you? Not just a pretty mask, huh? Just so you know, I had to sync up with the tower to fix it. I'm seeing all crime data in the area now. Looks like there's a break-in happening near me. Great. I've got units nearby. Don't bother. I'm on it. Open the safe! Do it! Hey, fellas. Ah! Spider-Man! Shoot it! Wrapped up. Thanks for that. Huh. Looks like Jameson's got a new episode out. Wonder what my number one fan thinks about the Fisk takedown. This is Just a Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, where listeners like you discuss the issues affecting our city with Pulitzer Prize winning two time! Two time. Pulitzer Prize winning former publisher of the Daily Bugle. Welcome to Just the Facts with J. Jonah Jameson, alerting you to the threats you don't even know about. Let's dive right into the calls. Speak. Okay, so not for nothing, you gotta give Spider-Man respect for taking down Wilson Fisk, right? I mean, one less mob boss is good for everyone. Is that right? Tell me, are you a police officer? Prosecutor? Maybe an award-winning reporter with decades on the job like me? Uh, no, I'm a plumber. Oh, good. Then fix my toilet and shut up! Let me explain something to you about crime bosses. Soon as one goes down, every punk with a gun, a tracksuit, and a drawer full of gold chains decides he's the next godfather. We're gonna have a gang war on the streets, but does that whip-headed moron give a damn? Of course not. We've got, got on TV. Uh, uh, you're the kingpin now, right? Uh, watch my back. Yeah, well, I can get copper pipe without paying kickbacks now. So until that gang war starts, I'm on the webhead side. And you'll be singing a different tune when three new mobs are lining up to charge you triple for that same pipe. Or just break your legs. Goodbye! Unbelievable. I understand we have another low information caller who thinks we're better off thanks to Spike. Let's see if I can set her straight. You're on with J. Jonah Jameson. I just want to say that I've never seen Manhattan so safe and peaceful. Compare what it was like when Spider-Man first showed up to now. Of course, we do have things now we didn't have then. Maniacs who shoot electricity out of their eyes? Walking piles of sand? Didn't Spider-Man put all those guys in jail? You're missing the point! They didn't exist before he came along! At best, he attracts them! Look, all I'm saying is, I'd hate to imagine what would've happened if all those guys showed up and Spider-Man wasn't here. Another lost cause. Goodbye. <sighs> Someday, Jonah. I'm gonna get you to say something nice about me. Someday. Voicemail from Yuri. Hey, silent alarm at the auction house holding Fisk's estate sale just tripped. Could you check it out? Quietly? I don't want to make a scene if it's nothing. Fisk estate sale? Sounds fun. Wonder what the kingpin had hidden in his closets. Sorry. Who would be dumb enough to rob Fisk's estate sale? Yuri said quietly. Better find a back way in. I am 
losing patience. Where is the file? There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? There's no one here but us. We will find the file, or you will die. This is bad. They'll kill her if I alert them. I need to pick them off silently. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunmen and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. Copy that. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. Hey, what is that? This totally belongs to... Don't move! Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Hey, Pete. MJ? What are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least... I was. Oh, I, uh, think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So, Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the Bugle? Well, Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh-huh. You're lucky to be alive! Says the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay, um... You hide back there, I take out the bad guys, you make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. It's exactly how I pictured it. Did she change her perfume? Focus, Pete, focus. Should clear these guys out before I push forward. Okay, Pete, I'm hidden near the front. Give the word and I'll make a break for it. Will do. How about that file? What's in it that these guys want so bad? Notes on something called Devil's Breath. Fisk was hired to build a secret research lab for it. Not clear what Devil's Breath is, but it seemed to scare Fisk. He compares it to Pandora's box. Not much shook Fisk. We need to get you and that file out of here. Hang tight. <laughs> Stop! No. Hide! Not cool with the hostage taking guys. Whoa, what is up with that glowy stuff? Are you guys ghosts? Never fought a ghost before. Ah, seems like this is an energy thing, not a ghost thing. All good. Fight a ghost that stays on the old bucket. Antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You, you will not write a word of what you saw. For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That I, I don't. What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney.
mix. Since when did mix become Italian? No idea, but I'm still glad to mix these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the bugle? Mm. Well, yeah, well, I just got an all caps text from Robbie about my so called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. As uh, soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask guys, what's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? I Maybe mean, we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> there's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but... Is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. Love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. Hey, it's me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker. Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from masked criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Hi, Herman. Seriously? Getting away. Can't lose him. personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Whew, I'm running out of steam. Time for a pick-me-up. Eddie's Pizza. Eddie, it's Spider-Man. 
Spidey, you sound hungry. You know it. Can I get the usual? Extra pepperoni? I'm on it. You want rooftop delivery? Yes, please. Same rooftop as last time. Give me a few. I'll let you know when it's ready. Pizza time. Oh, I love you. But now, I must destroy you. Peter, what can I do for you? I'm sorry to bother you, Mr. Lee. I have a friend, Mary Jane. She's a reporter. She's doing a story on art imports, and she found this piece. Well, she wanted an expert opinion on it, and I know you have a degree. And this might be the first time I actually get to use it. Let's see what you have. Interesting. Where did she find it? Well, I'm really not sure. What, what is it? A replica of an antique Chinese opera mask. I haven't seen one in years. This symbol here roughly translates to demon. Demon? My father read me ghost stories with that mask and symbol in it when I was young. It scared the hell out of me. Peter, listen. That mask, it's... It could be connected to dangerous people. Mary Jane might want to find a different story. Do you think she's in trouble? Take the risk. Hey. The symbol inside the mask means demon. It really spooked Mr. Lee. Never seen him like that. He even said you should drop the story. Fat chance. Do you think Mr. Lee knows more than he's letting on? No, I think he just had a weird flashback or something. I know his childhood was pretty traumatic. Yeah, that makes sense. Demons, huh? Catchy name. Okay, gotta get writing. See you soon. Well, that went about as well as I could have hoped. Let's do a little spidey work out in the city. What are you doing here? <laughs> oh, we got a fighter. <laughs> You just made your last mistake, punk. What the? You're Spider-Man. You're the amazing Spider-Man. You're the spectacular Spider-Man. And a few other choice adjectives Jameson uses. Look, that was really brave. But next time, leave the fighting to the pros, okay? Uh, okay, but... What if there aren't any around? Well, you can't just go swinging at someone twice your size. I mean, don't get me wrong. I fight guys stronger than me all the time, but when I do it, I have... Oh, oh like that time you fought Ryan on the Brooklyn Bridge? That was so awesome. Perfect <laughs> example. If the other guy's bigger, you gotta be quicker. Okay? Okay, but that's... It's easy for you to say. I, sorry, I just can't do what you do. All right, put him up. Seriously? Yeah, come on. First thing, don't let the adrenaline get to you. Breathe slow, breathe deep, relax. Hip square to your opponent. Let them make the first move. Now use your feet, and when they go off balance, look for an opening. Boom. Like that? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Okay, Not only this time, just let me have it. Right on the jaw, okay? I can <clears throat> Oh, sh- Sorry. No, no. No. It's all good. You keep that up and uh, you'll be fine. All right. Lesson's over. Gotta go. Hey. Uh, thanks. You know. Anytime. Just punch Spider-Man. Shoot a wet 
Spider-Man. Shocker has escaped. And now he's robbing a bank on East 31st. What happened? I thought he was behind bars. He was. But one of the guards just walked up to his cell and released him, then gave him his suit back. I knew Shocker was working for someone. What did you get out of the guard? Wish I could ask him, but he's dead. Whoever made him release Shocker didn't want any loose ends. Damn. Looking at the security footage, the guard was in some kind of trance. And it might have been the lighting, but it looked like his eyes were glowing. Well, that's creepy. Okay, I'll see what I can get out of Shocker when I get to the bank. Herman! Long time no see. Hey, I'm no lawyer, but, uh... Pretty sure that's a parole violation. Oops, guess we're stuck in here for a while. Wanna play 20 questions? No? How about we tell us? Okay, face punch it is. Whoa, your gauntlets are all digital now, aren't they? You wanna fight? Man, can't wait to put you back behind bars so we can talk science. Remember our first fight? Me so young and stupid, you just stupid. You talk so much. Well, that's a matter of opinion. I mean, are there any standard metrics for how much talking one should do? Also, how much measure? Okay, now I can do some real damage. Yeah. You found actual cash! You really want to rob banks? <laughs> Try day trade. It's all the rage. No. Wait, 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 wait. No, no. <laughs> oh, come on, Herman! You tell me who you're working for. I can help you cut a deal. If I talk, I'm dead! They made that very clear! <laughs> <laughs> Give up now and we can protect you! No way! You ain't see what I see! You son of a... Sorry, Herman. You brought this on yourself. Literally. He was scared and desperate. These demons are everywhere all of a sudden. Okay, Yuri. Shocker's all yours now. Good work. We have a special cell waiting for him at the raft. We'll make sure he stays behind bars this time. Also, I'm pretty sure he was working for the Demon Gang. Demon Gang? <sighs> Sounds like a Daily Bugle headline. Hey, the Bugle is a perfectly fine news organization. Not sure I'd call it news. Well, I've heard they have some really good reporters. Anyway, have you had any more reports on demon, uh, uh, guys with masks? Let me get back to you. By the way, how much of a mess did you make inside that bank? You probably don't want to know. <sighs> Shouldn't have asked. Hey, so I looked into reports of... demons. I knew you'd come around. They've been pretty busy tonight, hitting a lot of Fisk properties. They're going after Fisk? Damn. You thinking what I'm thinking? Brewing gang war? Let's try to get ahead of it. Are there any Fisk properties that haven't been hit tonight? Let me see. Patrol reported a bunch of activity at one of his shipyards in Portside. Any idea what Fisk uses that shipyard for? No idea. Let me send an officer to meet you there. His name's Jefferson Davis. That's his beat. He's a good cop. Been working the Fisk case for years. If anyone knows what's going on at that shipyard, it's him. You know we can't have vigilantes trespassing or doing illegal searches. Yeah, I know. Which is why I brought a warrant. So what do you say we do some perfectly legal searching? I like the sound of that. What's your name? Officer Davis. Call me Jeff. And you are? Uh... <laughs> Just messing with you. My son's a big fan. So, that warrant cover 
breaking down doors? Not without a lot of extra paperwork. Okay. I'll find another way in. Check around back. I'd go myself, but you know, not Spider-Man. I feel like I'm in a horror movie. Hello? Any fishermen with a grudge and a hook for a hand? Jeff, you there? I'm doing my best to refrain from knock-knock jokes. Appreciate it. You see a junction box powering the door? Yeah, got it. If we can overload it, that should force the door open. It's electric web for the wind. The gadget man, huh? You remind me of my son. Started taking apart the TV when he was five. <laughs> now he's unlocking his friend's phones. Sounds like he could teach me a few things. Okay. Nothing illegal in plain sight? Kinda anticlimactic, huh? At first glance. Let's look closer. Looking for something specific? This yard's been here a long time. Bootleggers used to use it back in the day. Gotcha. Well, that isn't spooky at all. Probably an old bootlegger's tunnel. And it looks like no one's cleaned it since Al Capone. Big chunk of concrete in the way. I can't get through. Let me see how it looks from the top. I'm blocked. Anything you can do? What was that? Subway, maybe. Let's hustle. Okay, that definitely wasn't a subway. No. Sounded like explosives. And that sounds like demons. The vault! Come on, let's go! Demons are already gone. How'd they beat us here? Must be a back door. See if you can find it. This place is one hell of an opening. Shh! Demons! Stay here. Hell no. It'll take both of us to stop him. Let's go! Get him! We've now identified the officer as Jefferson Davis. We're being told he has minor injuries and is expected to make a full recovery. Excuse me, miss. Are you supposed to be here? More than you. After that auction house thing, the bugle put me on the city beat, which means I get to focus full time on real stories like this and the demons. You know the closer you get to them, the more you become a target, right? The closer I get, the better chance we have to stop them. We? Officer Davis, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. No comment. I don't blame you. But these guys are going to tell their story with or without you. And they thrive on controversy. So what's your end? I don't have one. I just listen. Okay. Hop in. She's good.
Come on. Where am I gonna sleep? Guess I could try MJ's. All right. How am I gonna talk my way onto MJ's couch? MJ! It's just in the neighborhood and... Oh, that's lame. Hey, MJ. Now that we're talking again, I thought maybe... Okay, that's just pathetic. We're just friends, right? Friends crash on each other's couches all the time. It's not weird or anything. It's just MJ's couch. Uh, what am I thinking? Hmm, just got a web alert. Huh, looks like MJ's story just got published. I think I'll find somewhere else to stay. She's probably busy with work. I can't take this. You can and you will. I'll pay you back. Soon. Just ask for help next time. Oh, you are so much like Ben. You have to learn to swallow that Parker pride and accept that you're human, like the rest of us. Martin. I'm sorry to interrupt. I just wanted to let you know I'm headed out of town. You're in charge while I'm gone. Well, you can count on me. How long will you be away? Uh, really don't know. Is everything okay? It's some personal business I've been planning for a while. But please take care of this place. It represents the best part of me. Well, I guess I better get busy. <sighs> Hope Mr. Lee's okay. Hello? Hey, did you see my story? I did. Robbie must be pretty happy right now. Yeah, it kind of went viral. And get this, Mayor just announced he's going to give Officer Davis an award this afternoon. Wow. I'll be there covering it. Wanna join me? Yeah, of course. See you then. Hey, Jeff. Congrats on the ceremony today. I'll be glad when it's over. A truck full of armed demons scares me less than public speaking. But I'm calling about something else. What's up? Just got a tip that the demons are moving on the Fisk construction site in Midtown. My wife would kill me if I ditched a ceremony prep to play cops and robbers, but I thought maybe my friendly neighborhood partner would want to know. Understood. I'll do a swing by, let you know what I find. And hey, here's a tip on public speaking. Just picture everyone in their underwear. <laughs> Consolidated shipping. Jeff, I'm here. What do you see? Find the rest. Boss wants them dead. Looks like the demons are moving in on Fisk's territory. You got this? You got what you can, I got boss. This. You don't need to kill us, too. <laughs> Fisk's territory is ours now. Not today. Hey, Willie. You. Nice jumpsuit. Slimming. Stay out of my business. Wait, the demons. Who's their leader? Keep my men alive and maybe I'll tell you. Hey, big guy. Fisk, your men are safe. Your turn. Who runs the demons? Maybe he's there. Maybe he isn't. Check the roof. I've missed these cryptic Fisk talks.
Come on. No, 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 no! are so awesome. Where do you get them? Cool, thanks. Do they have a website? Yes. Whoops. Hey, Yuri. I caught the bad guys, but... But what? You might want to bring a ladder. Hey, fanboy. I'm late. You coming? Uh, nah, I gotta get to City Hall for my dad's ceremony. All right. Tell your pops I said congrats. There's the stage entrance. And we'll be right out front. <sighs> Sounds like a lot of people out there. You'll be fine, honey. Last time I gave a speech, I was in high school. Miss Steinberg gave me a C minus. Well, if only Miss Steinberg could see you now. Hey, you got this, Dad. You saved Spider Man. I'm pretty sure that makes you an official superhero. <laughs> a superhero? <laughs> or maybe I'm just a guy who doesn't give up. <laughs> Come on, honey. Welcome, everyone. And before I hand it off to Mira... So? I think this gang war may finally be over. 
Like, like over, over? Um, I mean, there's some loose ends still to be tied up, but... Loose ends? Well, a truck pulled away from the scene from a company called Consolidated Shipping. Something's not right about it. I just don't know what. Hmm. Well, maybe after this we can grab some coffee. Figure it out together. Yeah. Um... Well, thanks, Jim. Couldn't have said it better myself, but I'll try. We all know that Officer Davis is a hero. Maybe we could have dinner instead. I, I could come over, uh, I'll cook. Or we could, you know, meet at a totally neutral location for a completely normal meal cooked by professionals. <laughs> for acts of extraordinary bravery, above and beyond the call of duty, it is my privilege to present Officer Jefferson Davis with the Department Medal of Honor. Phone call, sir. Kind of in the middle of something here, Jim. Sounds urgent, sir. Fine. Congratulations, sir. Uh, thank you, Mr. Mayor. I share this honor with my family. My wife, Rio, and my son, Miles. Without their support, I... I couldn't do what I do. Yes? I've worked many years for this moment. Who is this? Over the coming days, your company, your city, and everything you care about will be destroyed. People will beg you for help, but you won't be able to save them. <laughs> Listen, jackass. I get threats like this twice a week. Why don't you grow a pair and tell me what you want? To watch you suffer. Nice 
going, kid? Are you okay? Yeah. I'm all right, Ma. I'm all right. You sure you're okay? Yes, I'm gonna be all right. Uh, uh, I'm gonna be all right. I'm gonna be all right. All right, Liz, I, 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 I have to go find Dad, okay? No, wait. Miles, Miles no. Miles, no! Right there. What the hell? Where do you think you're going? Stop! Frank, cut. You can pull your Give him a windy. I'll show you. I'll show you. We have to leave. Now. Dad. 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 I'm sorry for your loss. Do I know you? I'm Peter Parker. I was at City Hall when... Look, I know you don't know me, but I just wanted to say... I know what you're going through. Uh, That's what you were going to say, right? Or it all gets easier with time. Don't worry. It's, it's part of God's plan. I'm sorry. I was just try trying to help. I know. I'm sorry about that. I don't know what I'm going to do with him. Sorry, Jeff. I'm busy. What's up? Have you started looking for Martin Lee yet? I told you, I can't start a manhunt based on a hunch from Spider-Man. But I'm telling you, he's the guy! Get me some solid evidence and we'll talk. Solid evidence. Right. Consolidated shipping.
Copy, Silverbird. We're descending to location. There's another one. Safety's off. Well, this is new. No, no, no. This one's mine. All right. I'm executing this son of a... Hey! That's not how we do things! Down! Down! Code SM-1. Whoa, whoa! Before we do this, who the hell are you guys? Code SM-1. Code SM-1. Holding for orders. Copy Code SM-1. I have a visual. Hold for Silverburn. Nice entrance. Solid 8 out of 10. Nine out of ten. Release him. He works with us. Yuri, explanation, please. This is Silver Sablanova, head of Sable International, a private security force, paid for by the mayor. Oh, the mayor has a pet army now. Next time you get in my way, I will not be so gentle. Go. We'll talk later. Peter. So if you're running this place while Mr. Lee's out of town, who's doing your old job? <laughs> Me. But I could always use more help. You know anyone? Actually, I do. His name is Miles Morales. Why does that sound familiar? His father was being honored at City Hall. Oh. I talked to him at the funeral. He's a smart kid. He's just having a tough time. I knew a boy like that once. I remember it helped to uh, stay busy. It might help him too. Here's his mom's number. Thanks. I'll give her a call. Hey, you haven't heard from Mr. Lee, have you? No. Why? I'm just curious. I've got a few minutes before work. I'm gonna look around, see if there's anything else I can do to help you out. Oh, you, you don't have to. I know. I want to. I should check out Lee's office. May said you were at the bombing. I was praying for you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Hmm. This office is locked. How do I get in there? Quietly. Maybe there's a vent somewhere. Huh. Never seen that room before. That room I saw from the crawl space. It should be right on the other side of the shrine. I thought Lee's parents abandoned him. Why build a shrine to the people who threw you away? Whoa. What are you hiding, Lee? Can you feel my power growing? Feeding off my anger. Father would say I've lost the path of balance that he could never understand. The only way to fight a monster is to become one. Creepy. This is the folder MJ found at the auction house. This might help us figure out what Lee's planning next. Yeah. It's a burn room. Wired to destroy evidence. The police had found this. May. Don't want to think of what could have happened. Hello, Peter. 
Lee. I thought you were out of town. Did you find what you were looking for? Martin, you're back. You get that. Thank you. And heading off again shortly, I'm afraid. Just needed a few things from my office. You must have heard about City Hall. Yes. Tragic. Peter was there. He was very lucky. Well, what matters is you are both safe. Amen. But the bombers are still out there. Who knows what they've planned next? I don't think you or May have anything to worry about. As long as you stay away from places you're not supposed to be. Well, I should go. When will you be back? When my work is done. Wait, wait, wait! I finally got your evidence. Head to the Feast Center in Chinatown. What am I going to find? A nice lady named Mae Parker. And some really weird stuff hidden in Lee's office. But listen, he's got another attack planned. Where? When? Still working on that, but I think he's going to use something called Devil's Breath. Sounds destructive. What is it? A substance created by Oscorp. Probably a bioweapon of some kind. I have a folder full of info on it. I'm holding on to it for now. I'll send copies as soon as I can. Okay, we'll check his office. If the evidence stands up, I'll put out an APB. Peter! Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues. But why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath. Whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what, you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman. No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A partner. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh! Oscorp CFO! Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just the couch is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. Halloween party. Guess I don't have to change. Delaney's dressed as one of my greatest foes. Let's find out which one. Dr. Delaney is here somewhere. I have to find him before Lee does. Check out my moves! Excuse me, are you Dr. Delaney? Ha, Spider-Man, my nemesis. You won't catch me this time. Oh no, smoke. Whatever will I do? 
This is the end for you, Spider-Man! Now I have you! Hey, what's wrong with you? I worked on that helmet for a week. I need to find Dr. Delaney. He's out in the party somewhere. Who are you? I'm your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. <laughs> smart ass. That guy throwing down candy could be Dr. Delaney. I'm looking for Isaac Delaney. I think he's on the dance floor. There he is! The lizard in the lab coat. Hey look, it's Spider-Boy! Isn't some one of your nemesis? We gotta uh, fight! Later. Oh, what's the matter, Spider-Whip? You afraid of my mighty horn? Hey, hey, who? What, what are you... Come on! Hey! Uh, fight! Uh, Kick fight. his ass, Spider-Man! Yeah. What the hell? Oh, snap! Oh, my God! Is that the real Spider-Man? Uh, I'm right now! Oh, get him, Spidey! Yeah. What do you want? Uh, uh. Who are you? You recently began working with someone in an Oscorp lab. How do, you, how do you know that? We don't have much time, Isaac. Tell me his name. Show's over, Lee! Apparently the show's not over. His name, Dr. Morgan Michaels. Thank you. No! Yuri, I need your help. I've got reports of shots fired at ESU. Yeah, that's me. I'll explain later. But right now, you need to find a Dr. Morgan Michaels. Martin Lee's coming after him. Copy that. demon faces. You know what? Just, just keep breathing. I'll be back soon, Mr. Punch. Hey, hey Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no. I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of... 
protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic. It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. Oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Eh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these when CR they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Up time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. All right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerge that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty here. Hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. Let's see if Ant-Man needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. I'll grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Spider-Man, who is this Dr. Michaels? I think he's the head scientist on this Devil's Breath project. Did you find him? Yes. Sable says they have him under protection at a safe house somewhere in the city. We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the Devil's Breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381. Package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that?
giving you a new perspective. What the hell? I must be honest. I was hoping to bring you here. My abilities lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real? Or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! <sighs> One way or the other, you will join me! Uh -oh. All the souls you've lost! The innocent victims you couldn't save! Gordon! Their blood is on your hands! This isn't real! Their bodies filled the cutter, and you did nothing! I can't save everyone! The shadows are sworn to me, and I will give them strength. What? I just destroy the mask. I won't abandon you in the darkness, Martin. I will break you and leave you brain dead. No, you can't. Where's Lee? I have to go after him. Lee's escape plan is to use the train. Can't let him get away. Lee's getting away. Finally. Sorry I'm late. No problem. Ah, it totally worked last time. Yuri, we still doing construction on 42nd and 1st? Street closed for another month. Why? <laughs> Thank you.
Next up, prison. Watson, please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Uh, hey, it's me. Let me know when you want to talk. Texting isn't talking? No, 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 not that kind of over! You think? <sighs> Great. You did it. Lee's off to the raft. The Devil's Breath is safe with Sable. How do you feel? How do I feel? How much time do you have? Not much. Heroics for you means paperwork for me. But I just wanted to say, good job. Thanks, Yuri. I kind of needed that. Peter! Y you okay? I'm getting by. I don't know how I feel about you running this place all by yourself. And these people need help. If I lose a few hours of sleep, so be it. So have you heard from Mr. Lee since... No. But the Martin I know couldn't have done that. Whatever's become of him, that's not the one I want to remember. So, how are things with MJ? Oh, it's, uh... Well, you know, she's, uh... It's, uh... It's, it's, it's complicated. Honesty. That's what got me and Ben through the rough patches. You guys had rough patches? Oh, sure. Especially when we were your age. So, are you honest with her? Does she know the real you? Hey, turn it up. I want to hear this. A spokesperson for the police has confirmed that this was the truck carrying the device used in the Grand Central Terminal attack. Oh, it never ends. <sighs> Peter? Clear. The Devil's Breath is gone, but we've got even bigger problems. Rikers? We have to hurry. Hop on. What happened? It was a coordinated attack. Must have been planned from the outside. Every cell block is breached. We're minutes away from every prisoner and Rikers walking right up Fifth Avenue. What about the raft? Should be okay. It's a super mass facility. Better security and a separate power grid. Good. What about the Devil's Breath? Sable's handling it. Do you trust them? Do I have a choice?
Looks like things are somewhat under control. I thought you said the raft was secure. It was. Let's go. Maybe it's not as bad as it looks. Love the optimism. But in my experience, when it looks bad, it's usually worse. Look out! Ah! Uh! Ah! Yuri! Uh! I'm flipping! Gotcha! Hold on! Uh! You okay? Yeah. Welcome to the party! Just in time for the fire! Looks like we made parole, boys! Electro? Why is he letting everyone out? I'll head for the main control center and see how bad the situation is. Got it. I'll go join the party. Everyone just quietly go back into your cell and lock the door behind you, okay? Please? I'm gonna cut you, spider! Come on, Spider-Man! I thought this was a chase! My new suit! Dashing. Where'd you get it? It's an exclusive club. Hey, you okay? Yeah, fine. Can you, uh, can you pass us out for me? Sure. But they are working around the clock on a cure for this deadly disease. The citywide quarantine is being heavily enforced by Sable International, who maintain tight security over all transit points. Throughout the city, police and Sable agents continue to battle with Rikers and Rats. Electro, Fulcher, Lee. Why? How did I let this happen? Just got a call from the hospital. They said you went AWOL. I need to get back to work. The doctor said you still have 14 broken bones. Which means I have 192 non-broken ones. Thanks for taking care of me, by the way. The hard part was keeping you hidden from Sables. They branded you a priority target, you know. I humbly accept the honor. What is happening to our city, Yuri? I don't know. Feels like the end of the world. Maybe it is. This is our city, Yuri. It's time we take it back. 
Great. My men are tracking the supervillains. I'll update you when we make progress. Peter! Thank God! We need you at the Veterans Center. Where are you? Are you okay? What's happening? The convicts started a fire. We got the building staff out, but May and Miles are trapped inside. I'm trying to find a way into them, but the fire's spreading so fast. Stay where you are, MJ. I'll handle this. Damn it. Move it, Pete. Move! Peter, fire and rescue's on the way. I found a fire escape that'll get me- MJ, stay back! I don't want to have to rescue you too. Peter, don't be crazy. Wait for help. May! May! Everyone is safe. MJ, if it weren't for you and Miles, I would have been... As dead as I would have been the last eight and a half thousand times you saved me. Pretty sure I still owe you a few. <laughs> That's smart. <laughs> hey. I'm sorry I screwed things up. It's just hard being the one who always gets saved, you know? Sometimes I want to do the saving. I'm sorry I made you feel like you couldn't. Still partners? Always. Oh. Hey, uh, so I didn't know if uh, you wanted sparkling or, or flat or spring or mountain spring. So I got one of each. Am I interrupting? No, um... MJ, Ms. Watson, and I were just talking strategy. Strategy? That's right. The city is in danger. It needs our help. All of our help. All right, well, call the play, coach. Okay. Divide and conquer. Ms. Watson, we need an anti-serum for Devil's Breath. Oscorp's developing something, but there's no way they can keep it safe from Lee. We need to find the cure and protect it. I'll chase down some leads. Miles, you need to be my eyes and ears at feast. Anything goes wrong, call me. We need to keep that place and the people there safe. All right, you got it. What are you gonna do? Gang of costume nut jobs is taking the city apart piece by piece. Time I return the favor. All right. Hey, wait, um, how do I call you? I mean, do you have like a cell phone in your, in your po pockets or something? Ms. Watson can give you my number. Good luck, team.
you have his number. Are you Spider-Man's girlfriend? That'd be so cool. If... <sighs> Come on, Sherlock. Show me what you got in this water smorgasbord. Right over here. Until Miles gets back, the best thing we can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. How are you? Healthy? I'm good. How are you holding up, man? Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <coughs> oh. oh, there. <coughs> I'm okay. Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You're not Superman, you know. You and Ben. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Just a little rundown. Where's Miles? Could he help out? No, he is. He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief center. It's amazing how quickly we go through antibiotics. Okay. You stay off your feet for a bit. I'll organize the unloading and check in with Miles. Deal? Deal. Give me a chance to nurse my wounded Parker pride. Come on, Miles, answer. Don't make me worry about you and me. Quiet, quiet. So much for a milk run. How did a bunch of convicts even do this? I can't turn back. Beast needs those antibiotics. Oh, come on, Craig, be the one. Oh, Moxicillin. Perfect. Okay, so let me know I have these. Get off me! Just give us the wallet! Give it us, man! Help! Hey, leave him alone! Big mistake, kid. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? Like this? Haha. <laughs> Kids got guts. Hip squared. What the hell's he saying? Not gonna be saying anything in a second. <laughs> oh! Whoa. You want a taste? Nah, I'm good, kid. You want a taste? I gotta work on my fight banner. Miles? Hey, I've been trying to reach you. You okay? Hey, so, uh, don't freak out, but, um, I gotta fill you in on some stuff. Folks, the city is in crisis. We have bridges and tunnels closed. People who work in the city but don't live here are trapped within. Others have been barred from homes placed under emergency quarantine. I'm hearing reports of tent cities, people sleeping in parks. It's like the Depression and the 1918 flu epidemic all rolled into one. I know times are hard and we are all struggling, but if you see someone who needs help, do what you can. That's the only way we'll make it through this. We must pull together or fall apart. Jared, write that down. That was a good one. I've had numerous callers today reporting that entire city blocks are being taken over by escaped inmates from Rikers. These are literal no-go zones in the heart of Manhattan. A dystopian future from 70s movies come to life. Why don't the police stop it, you ask? Oh, you're going to love this. It seems the prisoners ambushed a convoy carrying weapons and ammunition for the authorities and took it all for themselves. The police are outgunned by their own guns! Well, all right, this is where the rubber meets the road. This is where we see if Sable International and Spider-Man are the protectors they claim to be. These criminals aren't hiding. They're right in plain sight, daring you to come get them. Well, we're waiting! Are 
Kravik's rough. Listen, Lee's gunning for the anti-serum. We need to find Oscorp's Devil's Breath Lab before he does. On it right now. Oh, every building permit is speedy. If there's a record in the lab, I'll find it. That's great. Okay. Uh, uh, talk soon, MJ. Softened him up. Time for Plan B. Heartwarming, Electro. You really grew in prison, didn't you? Ugh. Beat! You're up! No, Adrian! Beat Spider-Man! What are you babbling about? Nobody ever gets my jokes. Our long feud ends tonight, insect! <laughs> Thought we had a healthy give and take! Man, have I misread this relationship! Looks like that hurts! How many times have we done this dance, Adrian? A dozen? Two dozen? One too many! Tonight will be your last waltz! Spider-Man! I must break you! You got it! You got my joke! I'm so happy I can almost stop fighting! Almost! <laughs> Gotta be honest, liked it better when you two were loners! Attack while his guard's up. We need to stun or surprise him. need to catch my breath. Peter! Where are you? Peter, wake up! Come on, say something, please! They say she could go at any moment. Where are you going? I need to find Lee. He has the anti-serum. <laughs> Maybe you can't. Maybe Spider-Man needs help from his friend Peter. What? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Go get him, Tiger.
since I last defeated Lee, he's gotten a lot stronger. If I'm gonna beat him this time, I'm gonna need a better suit. Something that could withstand his negative energy. It's time to get to work. To get that anti serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach me. You harass my men, destroy my equipment, and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you right now. Listen, I don't like you, you don't like me. But Lee has your client inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. We could fight each other, or we could fight Lee, but not both. I mean we're good? You will help me secure my client. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. Please, out of control. I will talk to them. Oh, they friends. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just what is this? Oh my god, the mayor, he, he did this, he created this negative version of Lee, that's why he bombed the rally. I know about the accident, I know what happened to your parents. My parents died because of me. I won't let you do this, Martin. You're more than your past, don't let it control you. I tried so hard to make my parents proud, to honor their legacy.
sample. No! No, Martin! I told you, I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help... You don't help people. You use them. This won't bring your parents back. Why do you insist on trying to save this piece of scum? I'm trying to save you, Martin. Don't let revenge win. Fight it! still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others.
I'll give you a few minutes. gonna be okay ma'am i've got the cure right here take off your mask i want to see my nephew you knew i've known for a while i never wanted you to work i did And then me too. All the people you've saved. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. So? Hi, Mary Jane Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could do it. <laughs> what about you? Find a job yet? Oh, no, but uh... I'll be right with you, honey. Thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. <laughs> I mean, you do make a hell of a chicken curry. <laughs> I do. Still working on my dumplings, though. Going camping? Oh, uh, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I, mean, I, mean, I mean, yes, I mean, no, no, I don't I not want to, but meaning I, I, I do want to, but only if you do. I never stopped wanting to. Me neither. Whatever life holds in store for me, I will never forget these words. With great power comes great responsibility. This is my gift, my curse. Who am I? I'm Spider-Man.
fear it won't do And they say that a hero can save us I'm not gonna stand here and wait I'll hold on to the wings of the eagles Watch as we all fly away And they're watching us They're watching us as we all Watching